Okay guys, Big Slick here. Today we're going to repair a Hewlett Packard Office Jet. This one happens to be the R80 series. It has the typical message of scanner system failure, turn off and on again. This is generally due to a bad scanning bulb, so I'm going to tear this down and replace it. Okay, and we're inside that quick. Now the problem with these scanners is this fluorescent bulb here, it's usually defective. It wears out due to age just like any fluorescent bulb and it has to be replaced. Okay, so the bulb assembly is out now. Here is the bulb going right along here. As you see, these little rubber caps have to be pulled out, and then the new bulb has to be soldered onto the leads from the original. Okay, while we're in here, I took off the little driver board here and we're going to test the capacitor for ESR.
.4 isn't bad. We're going to go with it. Okay, while you're in here, be sure to put some light lube. This is CRC226 along this uh, path that the scanner travels. And also, you will see a guide wheel underneath the left side of this carriage. Put some light lube on that wheel to make sure it's turning freely and also you want to lubricate down here where this pivot and the same over here by the worm gear Over here on the carriage, I'll show you, this is the drive wheel. You will want to lubricate that also. And it's all reassembled, and as you'll see, the bulb is nice and bright now, substantially better than it was before. No error message, and we'll just throw a little junk document on here and give it a scan. And there it is, a beautiful scan, just like when the machine was new. Hope you got something out of this. That's how to refurbish the scanner on an HP office jet. Pretty much any older model. This is a parallel port model. Could be model R40, R60, R80, PSC. Pretty much any of those models. Thanks, bye.